our candidate. When I first approached Dan Barry's town committee to run for this seat a year ago, um, the first question I had is, well, you're a wonderful candidate, but you're not from here. And it wasn't news to me. I spent the year really working hard to, to learn Danbury through your eyes. And I have made wonderful connections in the community, and I've made great connections with all of you. I, would, I do know the results from the other towns, and the Senate race goes to Mike McLaughlin this year. Oh. Um, I have to thank my walk team of Gary Concalvis, Bernie Gallo, Frank Anders, Justin, am I missing anybody? Billy. Billy, oh my gosh, you walked with me. I mean, that the, the, we walked well over 4,000 doors. Wow. It was, I found out what it was like when you go for door-to-door uh, -door with Frank Andrews and you start at 9.30 in the morning and you're supposed to end at 4 and it's quarter of four and you finish the street and, and you say, Frank, you know, so we finished the street, it's quarter of four. He goes, you got 15 minutes. Let's, let's keep going. <laughs> so I, I want to thank all of the DTC chairs from all four towns. They all really worked hard. We really pulled together. I do want to acknowledge Frank Anders, who is, don't tell anybody, the best treasurer anybody could have, but he really is. So, And I have to give a shout out to Lynn Tabersack, who mounted the most amazing machine I have seen of, of coordinating all of these campaigns. And you were all so generous with your time. Um, Joe and Bob and everybody letting me come and walk with them. Thank you so much. And thank you. I thank Justin, my campaign manager, who came into a town that didn't know anybody and really Anybody in this room will know we ran a great race that we can hold our heads up high. I, I am very proud of this race. I am very proud of the face that it put out for the city of Danbury. I'm very proud of the issues that we raised. I knew it was going to be a liability when we put out a positive campaign in the middle of all of this. And I knew it was going to be difficult to run against a hometown boy. I did walk into this with my eyes open and realize it was an amazing uphill race. Thank you for the opportunity and the best time of my life from the bottom of my heart. Thank you.